Well, man overboard, that is Brett Ruskin right there in Port Mattoon, Nova Scotia yesterday. But why was Brett in the ocean? Well, it is lobster season and fishermen are preparing to head out to sea. And yesterday was supposed to be the opening day of the season in southwest Nova Scotia, but it was delayed due to bad weather forecasts. And now crews are focusing on how they will stay safe this year. With that, let's go to Halifax right now, Brett Ruskin. You know, Brett, I got to tell people at home, they you have to stay where you are because this is amazing video. We're going to dunk Brett into the water. <laughs> but first, let's start with uh, this year's lobster season. What are you hearing about it? I think I need a bumper sticker, Michael, that says, <laughs> why was Brett in the ocean? Yeah, exactly. Um, but yes, lobster season uh, is was supposed to get underway yesterday. But as you can see uh, the, from the, the waves and the wind from the flag, uh, not ideal conditions. And it is a, a tense day, the first day of lobster season. So they have delayed that first day. In the meantime, uh, lobster fishermen are doing training to ensure that they are safe training like man overboard drills of which I participated as the man going overboard. Have a look. A lot of people are kind of opening their eyes and realizing, you know, if I'm safe, it means I'm going to come home. Matthew Duffy has traveled the province sharing life-saving rescue techniques. All right, we're going to get started, guys. Today, he's been invited by Captain Gordon Burgess. Safety is number one. Yeah, I have one main rule. I've, my deckhand's there. I've told him I have one main rule. Stay in the boat. <laughs> but if someone does fall out of the boat, here's what you do. Oh, and today, that someone is me. Luckily, I'm wearing a survival suit. Duffy says that initial fall is becoming more survivable because more people are wearing PFDs. You're seeing people with their PFDs on and they're pretty dirty and full of, uh, you know, fish guts and stuff like that. So it shows that they are wearing them. To get me back on the boat, the crew <laughs> tosses me a life ring. The most common things we see um, is the life ring without the rope tied to it, um, which the person in the water is not really happy about. <laughs> then they tested a rig to lift me up. Watch the rope. <laughs> Tell me about the rope that was hauling me up. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I knew that so when uh, Matt said about using the basket. I told Danny there, I said, we should change that rope. and. That's been there for four years, so that's an eye-opener. See, that's been there for four years. It's time to change it. Yeah. So instead, they used a rig designed to haul in an unconscious or injured victim. It wasn't comfortable, but they eventually did get me out. All of this training is designed to keep people safe once this year's lobster season starts. An unconscious or injured victim or just a news reporter who <laughs> fell in the water, Michael. You know, the fisherman should have held you up and taken that photo like, look what we caught in the water today. <laughs> exactly. You wouldn't believe how big it was, yeah. <laughs> Brett Ruskin, you're a good man. Thank you for that.